Welcome back to Instant Replay Live and this disgusting monstrosity. It's like a giant crossed with the thing from Total Recall. Um, on the last episode, I started to talk about how we got to know each other, how we met, but then I got distracted by farts. <laughs> Which is often, often the way, isn't it? True story. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, I feel like gaming has been a part of our relationship for as long as we've been together. And I think that's an important thing. Like, spending time doing this gaming is always fun for me. I know it sometimes stresses you out. Yes. In particular when we're recording an episode. Yes. <laughs> it might turn up the anxiety a little bit more. A little. Um, but I took Rescue Remedy before I started filming. <laughs> really? <laughs> yes. Uh, doesn't surprise me. Um, but... Like, our first get-together was because we were doing this thing with a bunch of the other people at the pet store, um, where I was gathering um, everybody to get together and, um, sword fight with each other effectively, but with PVC pipe wrapped in foam insulation. Boffing. Boffing. We, so, it's not LARPing, you don't act as a character when you're doing it, you just swing on each other and beat the crap out of each other, and it is a lot of fun. I miss the days. Like, I really wish we were still doing that kind of stuff. But you overheard me telling some people and said, oh, I know what that is. Mm -hmm. And then I was telling people how to get there and you said, oh, I know where that is. Because what actually happened was that I had um, really no friends. And it made you cry inside. And it made me cry inside. But then, suddenly, and, um, there was a festival. I of was sitting on the uh, the bench outside waiting for my ride and um see see I'm doing bad no it's okay keep going um, the story is more interesting than the game I uh, was waiting for my roommate to come pick me up because uh, she was using my car and um everybody walked out at the same time and everybody went to the left and I went to the right with my dog and sat on a bench by myself yeah and then I thought well, I, I overheard you giving directions, and I, I thought, this is why I don't have any friends. <laughs> <laughs> because you don't. Because you went um, right. Yeah. Yeah. Because I went right. You took the blue pill. Um, and I, I thought, okay, now's my chance. I know where this place is. It's my inn. I mm -hmm. can go talk. Yeah. And I, I like, um, what am I trying to say? Well, you came over and you I, offered help with the directions. You said, let me help. I, like, Much like that. pumped myself up mentally enough to go over and talk. Because I didn't used to talk. Yeah. You still kind of don't, but, <laughs> but you've probably so improved. I so much more than I used yeah, to, Yeah, you've improved. Um, so you came over, and you said you know where that is, and you help people with directions, which is great. And then you asked if what we were talking about was SCA. Mm-hmm. Um, which is not, but it's a very similar group, except they have a sort of historical historical roleplay almost basis to it. Um, that guy's neck is <laughs> it's really <laughs> twitchy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's bothering me. Like I'm trying to tell this story, but I can't stop focusing on his neck movements being <laughs> not natural. Oh, ice cream truck. Oh, okay. Um. So. This is the part of the story where I love to say that our entire relationship is built on a foundation of lies. And every time he says that, I cry a little inside. Because <laughs> Just... it's hurtful. <laughs> well, because you specifically lied. <laughs> the first time any people... I didn't people... feel like I was lying. The first time we invited you to hang out, you were like, Oh yeah, I walk my dog by there all the time. I'll come over. Or maybe, or maybe I'll come and I'll bring the dog. And... Um... Instead of just saying yes to coming to hang out. Well, because I didn't know if I was going to at that point. Right, exactly. And so... Because I didn't do things by myself. So, so you walked the dog out. I tried to get my roommate to go with me, and she didn't want to. Um, and you still took that courageous leap. And I did. It was a big day for me. And look how it turned out. I know. Are you disappointed? Shit. <laughs> <laughs> but you brought the dog out. And we had a great time. Um, you and I sat and talked a lot. Mm -hmm. And we beat people up with swords. And there was much fun to be had there. Yes. And then um, you walked 
Or I walked you home that night? Mm-hmm. I yes. I I was totally a lesbian. Did I? Yeah. I don't think so. Uh-huh, because I asked you about one of the girls that was there. Oh, I don't think that registered. Well, you told me at one point that you thought I was a lesbian. This is... Mm, I think you're confusing things. I, it doesn't matter. I don't believe that, but it doesn't matter. So I walked you home, and... Um, <clears throat> It, it turned out to be a decent walk, but not unreasonable. But I then... I kept trying to convince you not to walk me home. Yeah. Because I felt like, you know, that was unnecessary. And uh, you assured me that you would walk me home even if I had been a small dude. Yeah, that's... That was my... My very... Um, God. Yeah. I was, I was just that? saying people shouldn't walk alone in the city at night, which I think is true, even though that meant that I had to walk alone right? afterwards. In the but I'm a big of dude. Where you lived. But I'm a big dude, so it's a very different thing. So, I, yeah, I can't believe I said that, though. Um, <laughs> I did say it. I mean, I remember it. I, I regret it. <laughs> the, I thought it was in Choice of words, yeah. Um,. Anyhow, oh, there's a minotaur. Of course, I thought anybody talking to me at that point was endearing. <laughs> um, so we got together after that, specifically because I wanted to ask you for, you know, into relationship mode, and you needed a roommate, and that was super awkward, because mm-hmm. we ended up moving in together immediately. I, didn't, I wasn't looking at... I wasn't really in relationship mode at that point. But I was. And you are a bit younger than I am, yeah. and I didn't think that uh, you would be interested in dating the older women's. <laughs> so, so you asked me to move in. I said I can't because we ended up moving in together anyways. The whole point of this story, the whole thing I've been trying to drive to, is that then, after I moved in, I found out exactly how far you walked the dog every day, which was to the field that was one house down. Like, That's because I stopped walking the dog once you moved in. No, you never walked the dog as far. That. You're going to try to keep this going now, ten years uh, later. You just said everything 11. was built on lies. <laughs> How can I stop now? Yeah. So you never walked out there with the dog specifically. And I did walk a lot, though. Yeah, yeah, sure. I mean, but we... you didn't bring the dog out there as part of your regular walk like you said all the time I do. Yeah. And I think my story stands. <laughs> Anyhow, then we started playing role-playing games. Well, we started playing role-playing games before I asked you out. But that You're was the other... You're playing a vampire LARP. Yeah, the vampire LARP and the adventure, like, 1920s pulp crazy. era tabletop role-playing game. And that's, that's, that's the kind of woman I knew I wanted. <laughs> Sucker. <laughs> so, now we have two minutes to kill. I ran out of time to tell that story. I mean, I ran out of story. Yeah. <laughs> We've been together ever since. Well, we broke up for like 48 hours one time. That's true. That's true. That's not a happy memory. <laughs> <laughs> but it's truth. It is. I think it made us stronger. <clears throat> sure. Like, getting back and then, you know, realizing that the absence was a real problem. Yeah. It's, yeah. uh, it takes not having something a lot of times to know that you want it, I guess. And ten years so. later... Merge. What have we done? <laughs> it did take us a long time to get married. The dog is whining the in the dog background. is, yeah, very upset that we're focusing on this boring story, I guess. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Not being entertaining at all. She wasn't around for any of that. She doesn't care. No. no. Much like everyone who listens to this show. Good point. Good point. <laughs> so. Will there Will there be cake? Mm, cake. Well, was that in the, th- the game? I mean, well, the Greek cake was. Okay. But they already know that. They already know that! No, stop. Don't do that. No. Vegetarians need not apply. <laughs> what? Sometimes I forget to talk into the mic, and instead I look at the person that I feel like I'm talking to, and then he makes faces at me. Well, sometimes I, you deserve to be... Bad faces. <laughs> you deserve to have some faces made at you. I don't know. No God, so much cutscene. I feel like this whole episode was cutscene. Cutscene and our terrible storytelling. 
That's what you get on Instant Replay Live. Thanks for watching. We'll pick up next time. Look, there's a cow. Part of a cow. Bow wow. Really kick it. Kick Yo, it. Plans. Free stroke. Sonic golf. Sonic golf.